Hello, hola, mabuhay, crazy universe. Welcome or I say welcome back to my channel. It's me again, your ultimate pageant buddy. I'm Ati Bang. Bang, 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 bang. Hello and namaste. For today's video, I would like to share to you my top of five best introduction of videos of the Miss Diva 2021. Well, this video is far different from my previous videos because after watching all the 20 official introduction of videos, of this stunning candidates of Miss Diva 2021, I made a lot of changes. So I will not keep you waiting, but before that, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell to so get notified every time I have a new upload. Let's get started. <laughs> If your internal voice says you can, external noises don't matter. Namaste, I am Siddhi Gupta, Leva Miss Diva 2021 finalist. Born and raised in the capital city, Dilwaro Ki Dilli. Just like my city, I am vivacious, versatile and full of optimism towards life. I am an economics graduate who has had the honour to work with the Ministry of Tribal Affairs, Government of India and many more renowned organisations and I'm presently working towards eradication of beggarly in children. I've been an athlete throughout my school life and sports has taught me confidence, resilience and teamwork. I love to travel, dance and I'm really fond of children. I've also been trained in ballet and contemporary and dancing is like a therapy for my mind, body and soul. My grandmom is the biggest inspiration in my life. Being a single mother, she educated herself and raised two children in this fast-moving city like Delhi. My life so far has been a roller coaster ride. Sudden weight gain, skin-related issues and anxiety due to my PCOS ailment have challenged me at every step. But I keep telling myself, hey, you're stronger than this. I'm self-motivated and do not need an external source of validation. Why I wish to be next Leva Miss Diva is because she's somebody who's not just aesthetically beautiful, but someone who's confidently beautiful, somebody who's strongly opinionated and compassionate towards society. I wish to bring glory to my country, my people, and make everyone proud. Namaste. So I think CD is part of my top of five because you can notice her eloquence and she has this commanding presence and knowing that she's working with those renowned organizations, this is really impressive. I love the way she talks and there's a connection between what she's saying to her goal and that is something that has impressed me the most. And now here is my number four. Jaipur, the city of warmth, culture, and heritage, is where I spent most of my childhood and teenage years. Here I learned that the only barriers I have are the ones in my mind, and if I overcome those, the world is truly my oyster. Growing up, I could never see myself fit within the predefined beauty standards. From the color of my skin to the scars all over my body, I was imperfect in every way. But the day I decided to wear my flaws like an armor, I realized that I'm so much more than a reflection in the mirror. That day, my life transformed. At the age of 17, I moved to the United States for higher studies. It was the first time I let myself free to learn, adapt, and persevere. But looking at the economic and financial crisis caused by the COVID-19 pandemic, I decided to move back to India and started my venture Unicash to enable the common man in India to earn, invest, and be financially free. Amongst the things that I've learned in life, there's one thing that's always stood out, that life is how you see it. And I aim to inspire women and men to break free from whatever holds them back and find their true happiness. I'm Sonal Kukreja and this is my story. Wow, amazing. I mean, she's so gorgeous and uh, listening to her introduction, I it's so soothing in my ears like i love to learn more about her i love to listen more about what she is saying she's so gorgeous and also i love her 
her speech, her eloquence, and also she's so phenomenal. So that's why I think I put her on my top four. Sonal is amazing. She is gorgeous. I'm, I'm looking, uh, I'm looking at her as like the Mr. Prenational winner. So hopefully, maybe. <laughs> Let's keep on watching. Now we are down to my number three. Rack number three. Let's watch this video. Hi, I'm Ojasvi Sharma, Leva Miss Diva 2021 finalist. I'm a 24-year-old from Delhi. I graduated with a neurosciences and neuropsychology degree, but because of my family values and just innately, I've been more spiritual than logical. Aww. Since I was a child, I loved being in front of the camera, dressing up and posing, dancing, acting, while my parents captured all of it was an everyday thing. It was going well until I was diagnosed with severe depression. I was 17. Experiencing depression at that age and at a time when not many people knew about or talked about mental illnesses was a challenge for me and my family. But sometimes in life, things get worse just to get better. I was a part of an NGO whose founder was a master of meditation. I practiced meditation every single day as taught to me. And here I am now. Today, Aww. I want to use my experience and this platform to open people's eyes to this gem that our Indian culture possesses. Thank you. Aww. You know guys, watching this video, I was so moved. This is really inspirational and this is personal. This is what I call introduction video. She caught my attention and uh, this this introduction is more than what i'm expecting this is really inspirational i love how she delivered the message i am so connected with everything that she's saying this is so inspirational so i put her on my top three and i think she will get one of the crowns hopefully she's really one of the strongest candidate in this year's pageant let's keep on watching and now we are down to my top two. Who do you think is my top two? Let's watch this video. Vanakkam. My name is Tarani Kalingarayar and I'm a proud finalist of Leva Miss Diva 2021, hailing from the culturally rich state of Tamil Nadu. I'm a 22-year-old graduate of Bachelors in Visual Communication, where I studied photography and filmmaking. Being behind the lens of a camera brought me the most joy until I discovered that being in front of it brought out a whole new side of me and this newfound love eventually turned into my profession and I currently work as a full-time model. When I'm not working, I spend my time in the forests of the Nilgiris where my grandfather has been living for over 30 years now. His love for nature ignited a passion in me towards forests and wildlife. My goal is to spread awareness about the pivotal role that forests play when it comes to protecting nature's biodiversity and maintaining ecological stability and ultimately igniting this passion for nature in every citizen of our country. I grew up in a family that has its roots in four different states in India and I guess you can say that I've experienced Indian culture in all its diversity. As I embark on this journey of a lifetime, one step closer to realizing my dream of representing our beautiful country and its 1.39 billion people, I am so very grateful. Thank you. So I put her on my top two because she is so beautiful and also the way she speaks is very sincere. It's heartfelt. You know, watching her is just like I'm seeing a goddess. And her beauty, her close-up shots. Oh my gosh, I'm so obsessed. I think I I didn't see her on my first video. So I think in here, I think she shines the most. 
she is totally totally beautiful and different from the video that I watched from the last time so I'm so excited for her I mean yes she is more than beauty okay so let's continue now we are down to the major major top one who do you think is my favorite to win the Miss Universe India I think you're right let's watch this video when I was born my mother was asked to throw me away because I was a girl child I was born and raised in Islam by my parents in the absence of bathroom in the absence of water food and electricity my mother being the first entrepreneur of my family made sure that I receive education I used to work with my mom and sister in the evening studied under the lamp post and walked my way to school every morning I am Ankita Singh from the city of Joy Kolkata a graduate in accountancy and a model by profession realize the importance of education the importance of being independent for a woman from a very young age during my college days i gave tuition classes and did bridal makeup to support my family and to fulfill my dreams of coming in front of the camera my journey and struggles of coming this far makes me believe that i can inspire the lives of many no matter where we come from what we are told with hard work will power and dedication we can achieve anything to bring a change in this universe Wow, I mean this is so inspirational and I think the universe needs Anki to sing. Okay, so I think she's my Miss Universe. Okay, no need explanation, but I feel like she is the one. The Miss Universe Diva organization should send her to Israel. She is my Miss Universe. I hope you like this video guys and if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell to so get notified every time I have a new upload. Bye!